Um, God, I mean, a lot. You know, just, like I said, I got a post game. Uh, with Kristen, I let a lot. Just you know, my thoughts and prayers go out to go and his family. Hope for a speedy recovery, you know, healthy recovery. Um, I've seen a couple uh, injuries like that in my lifetime. I've seen Paul George when it happened to Paul. Um, I've seen, I was watching the game with Sean Livingston when he was with the Clippers. And, and I was watching um, NCAA basketball with uh, Kevin Ware when he was at Louisville. Um, and those are, those are just those are the you know, injuries that you, know, you never see coming. You never know what to happen, no matter who it is, no matter what the stature, no matter how much competitive nature that you have. Um, it's just uh, very unfortunate. You know, it takes a few. It takes a little while. Um, and that's, I've never seen nothing like that before. And, um, the only thing you can do in that moment is pray. Um, pray for him. And like I said, pray for his family. And then, you know, um, as he's going out to the locker room, just give him some respect and some love. Um, but it's tough, you know, in this game. You never want to see injuries, you know, especially like that um, to a player that um, was really looking to have a big year, you know, in Boston. Um, that's the part of the game, the game of basketball that really sucks, is the injury part of the game. Even though he's on the opposing team, you know, we're still a fraternity and, um, you know, we're still brothers. And um, you never want to see anyone get injured and go down like that. I'm not sure the severity of the injury, but um, I wish him well. Um, he's been a great a player in this league, an all-star, and um, a great a great model sense as far as the NBA is concerned. So just wish him well. I hope he gets well, but I don't know, what, you know exactly what's wrong with him.